Somebody stop me! Welcome back to another guide and thoughts on the G127 with MCZX. This is night 13 and 14. Let's get right into night 13, which may be my least favorite night of all of the G1 so far. Fun fact, Han was on commentary for night 13, and it is not pleasant on the ears. His voice is like... Your grandfather who smoked too much, so he has a really graspy voice. It's very gravely. Think of the landlord in the first Ace Ventura movie. It's kind of like... <laughs> it's like, oh, God, that is not good. Please stop talking. Hanma has a really weird voice. I got to tell you that. It's a very weird voice. I'm glad to see Hanma back. At least he's doing commentary. Hopefully he'll be back in the ring soon. I think I was either burned out at this point or the card was just not something I was interested in at all. Because night 14 is way better. Trust me, it's way better. But night 13's card is so boring. I'll tell you right now, you can skip all the tag team matches if you want to know who won what. Bullet Club won the match with Oka and Kitamura. Suzuki Gun won the match with... Elgin, Tiger, Mass, and Kawato, L.I.J., Sonata, and Bushi beat Tenkozy. No, I'm sorry. Tenkozy beat L.I.J. with a lariat by Kojima. Bullet, Omega, and Owens versus Juice and Finley. Juice won with Pulp Friction. Congrats, Chaos. Okada Yano versus L.I.J. Evil and Hiromu. You can skip that. It was a punch in a dick city, so Yano won the match. And the A-block matches, even those I wasn't that fond of. There's only one, two, there's only three of these I'd recommend. I'd recommend Nagata versus Ibushi. It was a great opener. Awesome match. Great, awesome match for sure. Watch that. Fale versus Tomohiro Ishii. I thought it was going to suck, but it didn't. It didn't. It was another awesome match. Two for two. And the other great match of the night was Naito versus Zack Sabre Jr. Holy hell. Holy hell. Good God. Those are the matches you should watch. The ones you should skip for sure is Goto and Yoshihashi. Talk about boring. Absolutely boring. I don't like neither one of the gimmicks. And to see them wrestle, they're not bad wrestlers. But God, it's boring. It's not two faces who are exactly the same. There's nothing for me. It doesn't do a thing for me. I don't want to watch it. And Magabe versus Tanahashi, you can skip because it was really predictable who was going to win that match. Tanahashi won that. And Goto won his match. So let's get to the best night of the G1, in my opinion. Night 14. It started with a rare singles match to open the show with Kitamura versus Chase Owens. Kitamura is the jacked one. He's jacked, brother. He is jacked. Look at the pecs on him. He is jacked. And he was over as hell. They did a call for him and everything. I told y'all he's one of the young lions you should keep an eye on. I watched the match despite the outcome being obvious because Kitamura does do a couple things in this match that was very impressive. Very impressive. He's going to be a big star in New Japan if he stays there. Let's get to the A block tag team matches. You got Nagata and Umino and Yagi versus Suzuki Gun. Skip it. Suzuki Gun wins. Tenzan and Oka versus Bullet Club. Skip. Bullet Club wins. Makabe, Tiger Mask, and Kawato versus LIJ. Naito. Skip. Tanahashi. Ibushi Finlay versus Chaos. That's Goto, Ishii, and Yoshihashi. Watch that. Very good six-man tag match. Also, also quick note, in that Makabe, Tiger Mask, Kabuto, LIJ match, you should watch the post-match stuff between Makabe and Naito. That was very funny. Very funny. Let's get to B Block. And the winner of the Most Entertaining Match Award goes to Yano versus Tamatonga, our first match of B Block. <laughs> I love both of them. I love the f***ing hell out of Tama Tonga and Yano. They are great. And Tonga knows how to play everyone's style. He's a perfect mimic. And I love it. Watch that match. Kojima vs. Sonata. May, it, it may feel a bit underrated, but it was another amazing match. Then you got Elgin vs. Suzuki. 
Episode 7 of the Master Class of Torture and Being a Sadist. And the student was Michael Elgin. There's a weird rough bump in the match. It's an amazing match. You should watch that one as well. Juice Robinson versus Kenny Omega is a special moment. It's a special moment. I know the outcome seems super obvious, but it's a very special moment. Watch that match. It's pure joy. That's the only hint I'm going to give you. Pure joy. And Okada versus Evil, another special match. Oh my god. It's a shocker. It's amazing. It's 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 10 out of 10. Five stars. Watch that match too, because if I say anything else, it's going to give it away. This is my favorite night of the G1. Hands down. Hands down. And that is everything you need to know about nights 13 and 14. My favorite matches were from night 13, Ishii... Versus Fale, and from night 14, Omega versus Juice, and Okada versus Evil. Evil. That was awesome. Just a great show. And that's it. You know what to do. All the links are in the description. Follow us, leave a comment, like, share, subscribe. See you at night 15 and 16. Bye bye now. Peace.